everybody. I think I've managed it. I think I am live simultaneously on Facebook and Instagram. Facebook, I get to do all the fancy like backgrounds and all the things. But even though I don't have that on Instagram, I'm feeling really proud of myself that I figured out how to be in two places at once virtually. And like by not paying for a program that allows me to be. So yay for workarounds. Hey, everybody. Buenas noches. So happy to be here with you tonight. So pumped up, whether you're watching on Facebook. I see there's two of you on Facebook, seven of us on Instagram. Hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. <clears throat> I wanted to come tonight to talk about La Familia Loca. You can hear I'm losing my voice because <laughs> I talked a lot about La Familia Loca this week and very passionately and excitedly because it is my greatest my greatest passion outside of my family is my greatest professional passion. Um, sharing what I am doing in my classroom with other educators, um, what is working, what is not working, and how I am um, finding moments of joy with my students. So um, I wanted to come on tonight and talk to you about it and answer some questions. I received 10 questions on Instagram today. I didn't see any on the Facebook post However, I haven't checked recently and maybe I need to do that. Shall I find a way to be in another place at once? Perhaps I can. Um, so I'll check and see if there's more questions. Oh, I love you since I have fun. Have fun, Margaret. Um, teaching in Japan. Love that you joined for a minute. Thank you. Thank you. Um, okay, so. La Familia Loca PLC, what questions do you have? If you are here with me live and you have questions, let me know. Uh, I just read something from somebody online. Yay, 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 yay. Okay, huge win. Okay, <clears throat> first question that has come up and it's come up frequently is, what if I can't attend live? Oh, hey, Shane, Shane's familia. Shane, I'm not put you on the spot. I might bring you on to answer one of these questions. <laughs> For real. Um, <clears throat> one of the questions that has come up over and over is like, I am super busy, both personally and professionally. I don't know if I'm going to make it to your live sessions. And I that's important. That feels important. Well, people have lives and people have kids beyond um, our work, which thank God you do. Um, and I hope that you would prioritize that. That's why everything is recorded. Every single thing I do for La Familia Loca PLC is recorded outside of, I lie, outside of happy hours. Sometimes we don't record happy hours because we want to keep our happy hours like super secret because sometimes people who are not sober have something to drink and then they want to talk about all the things. So we don't record happy hours, but everything else we record because I want everybody to be able to engage. Um, and I have people in Australia and Nigeria and in Japan that can't engage all the time when it's a nighttime session. So that's uh, an important piece. Um, next question from earlier. Oh, Heidi's here too. Heidi, I might have to bring both of you on. I wonder if I can bring both of you on. If I touch your face. Let's see. If I touch you, your face, I don't know if I can request it. Heidi, Profe Bennett, and Shane. If Heidi, Profe Bennett, or, or Shane want to join me and answer one of these questions, didn't tell you this was going to happen, but boom. If you want to, you're welcome. Um. <clears throat> the oh the next question is where are the resources posted like how do we get access to the resources resources are posted in the same platform and portal where you access the recordings so let's say I know Facebook is seeing my phone pop in that's because I'm holding Instagram and watching Facebook at the same time um <clears throat> this you have a membership portal which is where you access all the goodness. Um, and in your monthly folder, you're going to see a calendar at the top that calibrates with the event calendar. So you always know when our events are and you can even add them to your own Google calendar from there. 
You can also add them from your from the emails that I send. Um, but inside that are all the recordings and all the resources that we share. Anytime we share a resource, we share in French, English, and Spanish. I thought I put that out there very clearly, but I've had so many teachers contact me this week saying, hey, I don't teach Spanish. What about the resources? And I'm like, French, English, and Spanish are the languages we are putting the resources out. A German teacher in um, Idaho contacted me and said, hey, what about German? And I'm like, maybe if I get some more members, I can hire you to do that for me. If I get more Chinese members, I would love to hire that out and translate those. But right now I have a ton of French teachers, a ton of Spanish teachers and some ESL teachers or um, what is it? I know there's several ways you, you were referring to it now, but those that is why I create the, the resources in multiple languages and I have people help me translate them. And my favorite question that I was sent today my favorite question was, how do you do it all? Not even related to La Familia Loca PLC, but how are you doing all the things, Annabelle? You are a mom, you are a of, of a toddler, um, a stepmom of a kiddo in second grade, you are a full-time teacher, and you're leading this full-time second business. <clears throat> the answer is very simple. I don't do it all. I literally don't do it all. I have Team Loca that helps me with everything. So people on Team Loca, Viviana Tracy, who has been with me from the beginning, Viviana takes my brain and makes sense of my brain and makes everything beautiful. Um, Morgan, Nicole, and Chio are members, team members that I hired this year to help me because we've grown to the point that I can hire help. Um, I don't know if I can answer anything, but I love listening to you. Heidi is a new member that joined us this year. Heidi, I would love if you don't want to join, if you could just tell me in the chat what's one thing that you've loved about the community this year for you, because you as a new member, instead of a founding member, were coming in at a different place, right? So I'd love to know what you, how you have benefited or grown um, right now. Collaborators, yes. So. I have a team that supports my vision, believes in what I do, <clears throat> and believes in the program promise of La Familia Loca. Our program promise is, and I say our all the time because we are truly a community. Um, Heidi, you just have to request to join. So you, I think you have to just hit something that says request. Our program promise is you will develop and enhance your skills with acquisition driven instruction in a supportive and uh, a supportive and understanding community to unlock unprecedented joy for you and your students. Because joy is hard to come by right now. We are tired of the apathy. We are struggling day by day to like we're begging for smiles and engagement and also buy-in. I'm like, buy-in buy -in is so hard right now. But La Familia Loca PLC is where we can come together and really hone in on a strategy and focus for the month and focus on how can we better ourselves this month? How can we get better, do better together for our students to unlock that joy? What's working? What's not working? Um, joining me on Instagram right now is one of our members. So excited. Heidi, I think I touched the button for you to join. I don't know if it works or not. Um, if it didn't work, I'll keep talking. Um, but on Facebook, you won't see Heidi, but hopefully you'll hear her and I'll be able to talk about what she's saying. So that's truly the program promise. And the people that I hire on my team are all teachers too. And this was important to me because I don't want to add more to the plates of teachers. I asked each of them personally if that was something they'd be interested in. Hi, my Pat. Um, and each of them said yes, but Morgan is a full-time high school Spanish teacher. In fact, she's commenting on Instagram right now. So if you don't follow Profe Bennett, you absolutely should. She puts out incredibly thoughtful posts not all the time, like when she puts out content, it is thoughtful and very intentional. She is working in Virginia. She is doing this work, y'all, creating inclusive spaces 
for all of her students. Her students feel seen, heard, loved, cared for, and empowered in her space. And when I hire people onto my team, I want to make sure they have the same values as I do. So Profe Bennett, Nicole Fitting, Shio Jacobi, who's also on Instagram um, as Rocio Jacobi, or uh, um, I'll, I'll look up her handle and drop it in the recording. But these are my leaders of the different cohorts because once a month we hold a space, just like Morgan said, we create space for work to be done and <clears throat> for us to share our wins for that month with the strategy and focus and where we want to focus our energy more. Um, yes, absolutely. Thank you so much. <clears throat> um, that brings me to like, what are the benefits of La Familia Loca PLC? There are eight benefits. That's seven, but there's eight because y'all are, if you come in now, you not only unlock bonus resources from the first two years that I opened the PLC, it's six incredible bonus resources. If you join monthly, those are unlocked one at a time over six months. If you join annually, those are all unlocked all at once. But in addition to that, you get August, September, October, November, December, January, February, seven extra months of bonus content, videos, resources, all that we've done since the beginning of this year, which is a tremendous, tremendous amount. Um, and even if you just go in there and like, I'm using the resources tomorrow, then you use the resources. The benefits are a workshop, monthly workshop strategy and focus with me a guest of the month, I hire out because I don't know all the things I need to hire experts within our world language community to talk about things that I don't feel an expert on. And this is special. It's like an intimate session chat. It's low key. It's like you bring your wine, cheers, and you sit in your PJs and you chill and you listen and you ask questions and it's beautiful. It's awesome or you don't bring your wine and you bring your water, whatever you want. Um, that's another one. Um, you get the resources, monthly resources in French, English, and Spanish. There is not a set curriculum. And I do that intentionally. We can talk about that in a second. Um, there's our community work time session, which we have, Morgan has spoken about that. Um, and then let's see if this works again, Heidi. Um, we have our Lanyap session, which is my favorite. It is our community work time where not work time, work on our personal selves. Sometimes it's yoga, sometimes it's Zumba, sometimes it's let's take this drawing class from the art teacher at my school and sip our beverages. Sometimes it's a trivia night. People are really into the trivia night. Sometimes it's a happy hour, whatever it is. It's something that like is not related to work. Um, let's see, and then there's the live Q and A with me. And I think that covers it. Yep, that's everything. So really, I want to develop you professionally, but I also want to work with you on a personal level and make sure that you feel like you are growing personally. Heidi, if it doesn't work this time, I don't know what to do. I've hit accept a million times and it's just not working. Let's see if it works with Profe Bennett. Um, okay, another question that came up today was Hola, Profe Bennett. I wish Facebook could see you, but they can't. I'm obsessed with your messy bun. This is what I want to talk about. Profe Bennett, how do people usually show up to our live events? They show up however they want to show up, which is why I'm being real with all the people on Instagram right now. And I'm showing up in my pajamas to show you the kind of community that we have created in this space it's incredible it's amazing it's a zero judgment space we are real people just like you and i was like i have to jump on here really quick because i was one of the people that was on the fence about joining do you remember this yes and you reached out to me you were like i need to know if this is really for me like before i make this commitment because i recognize it's a financial investment and we don't make money yes. like it is a huge commitment for teachers, especially teachers who, like you, are paying out of pocket. 
Right. And that's honestly, that's what I wanted to come on here. This was not planned, everyone. This was not planned. I wanted to tell everyone that I am like many teachers out there. I struggle financially. And so even the smallest amount has to be budgeted into my expenses. And I can tell you without a shadow of a doubt that this was one of the best things I did professionally in terms of professional development. So yes, I have community, but I also gained a lot of access to teaching techniques and methods and supports that I hadn't really experienced in other spaces. Um, Annabelle does a great job herself and bringing in other people that give a lot of examples and break down how to do the teaching. A lot of times we attend sessions and they give us a lot of information, but then we don't really get to see it played out or we don't get to participate in it, or we don't get to see the breakdown of a video with all the pieces of every single activity. We get this in this community. And so I've been able to perfect and like, adjust my own acquisition based instruction from this community. And so in addition to getting support and having amazing people around you all the time and, and being able to share and collaborate, you're also getting an opportunity to learn things that you're not going to learn in other spaces. So I had to say that I don't want to take up a bunch of your time, That's but it. it's one of my favorite <clears throat> things about this community is I actually get an opportunity to legit learn. Like I see you put these videos out and they make sense. You break it down. You know, you do it by theme. You're like, okay, today let's talk about these interactive games or today let's talk about this. And it just makes sense. And I go back and I rewatch the videos all the time. You literally tell me this and I'm like, Morgan, you know the things. And she's like, no, I'm in the portal right now. I'm watching again because even though it was there and I'm part of your team, like I can always bring back things. And I think that's powerful too. Like the fact that you can go back. And I want to go back to what you said at the beginning because I think that that's so important you show up as you are, you show up as you are. And if you had a terrible day and your eyes are puffy, you show up as you are because we are all there. And I think that that's so important that we can show up authentically as ourselves. When I'm pushing you to do that in your classrooms, I want you to be able to do this in this space too. And we have a member who I always call her out on it, Jennifer. Jennifer never comes on if her hair and makeup are not perfect ever, but she will watch live, but with her camera off, which is okay. But I want you to show up authentically as you, how you feel most comfortable all the time, because this is not easy work. We are, we are, we are busting our asses every single day. And yeah, we are teachers. Yes. We are exhausted, yes. but we show up because we have community, because we have support, because we have people in our corners that know what we're going through. Yes. There's nothing worse than having no one to really understand what the teacher life is, what being a world language teacher is. So to find that community is just gold. It's it's amazing. It's wonderful. It is. Thank you, Morgan. You're the best. I love you. I'm going to head out on that note, but I had to join. So I Thank love you. you. I am so going. grateful for you. I'm grateful for you. I love you. I love you. Um, God, that was special, huh? Um, she's incredible. And if you're not following Morgan, you absolutely should. She posted something yesterday that was just like dynamite that she created for her classes. And when I, she shared it with me, I was like, are you making this a post? This is incredible. Okay. Facebook. Gaby asked how many members do you have and do we get to meet them? So I didn't, I, I hoped that somebody would jump on tonight and so grateful that Morgan did. Heidi is here as well. Heidi is in the comments saying she loves the community work time sessions. Heidi brought it back to the students as well. Heidi said her students have benefited. She said, I have tried many things or I've tried a lot of things and found great success and my students benefit. And I think ultimately that's what it comes back to. How can I increase the joy in your classroom, not just for you, but for your students? Because the apathy is so much this year, more than I've ever experienced in my entire career, probably all put together. So what can I share with you 
to lessen the apathy and bring more joy, more smiles, right? How many members? We right now have 220 in our membership portal, but there's still some people in the old platform that I left in August who haven't migrated over. The other people that are in the Facebook community are my friends and family who literally are like, I don't care that I don't teach languages. I love the community. I want to just shout out teachers every now and then. So they're like the lurkers that don't really participate. Um, but that's what, that's how many members we have. And that's why I was like, okay, it's time I can hire some more people because it was really just Viviana and I for so long. As far as meeting them, yes, in live sessions. When you join our community, we meet up in those live sessions. And my favorite, again, is those lanyard sessions because we get to know each other in a deeper level than just where we teach and who we teach and what levels we teach and what language we teach. Um, and that's what's really, 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 really special. Um, okay, another question that came up today that I get frequently is what if it, I figure out it's not the right fit? Cool. If it's not the right fit for you, it's probably not the right fit for us in our community. Um, there's a seven day money back guarantee. If you come in and you're like, dang, like this is not what I was thinking. You can leave no questions asked, you'll be refunded. Um, I think people are nervous about the commitment and they just need to know that because there's a financial commitment and because some people are paying out of pocket that they don't have to have that worry. Join, I, I am, 90% sure you're going to love it, but every now and then there is a person who it just doesn't fit and that's okay, that's okay. Um, let's see what other questions you have. Cool, I know Viviana, this would be great. And you're a Louisiana girl, so there's an extra level of fun in La Familia Loca Louisiana chapter, I swear. Nalan Taylor is also in the group. Um, we have a lot of Louisiana folks. It's growing all the time. Um, I finally got, uh, oh my God, I almost said Viviana again. I'm so tired. Teresa, to join Teresa York. Teresa has presented for us twice and finally was like, I really want some of what you have. Like every time I present, like ah, I just want that energy. Um, and she presented on us uh, on um, theater games in the world language classroom as our lanyard session last, last month. It was so fun. And she decided to join. Um, if I join by the end of the month, can I pay just month to month the next? Okay, so the doors to La Familia Loca are closing on Friday. If you are waiting on department funding, I might need my husband to bring my charger. Husband, Paul, can you please bring me my charger? My husband is my hero. Like seriously, y'all couldn't do any of this without him. Um, the doors close at midnight on Friday, central time. There are a few people who are requesting funding from departments and they have sent me confirmation that they've requested this funding and I'm pinning a seat for them at the current rate. Because every time I open La Familia Loca PLC, the rate does go up because the value is increased. And honestly, the value I've marked it at now isn't even what you're getting every month. Um, my personal opinion is the guest guest speaker alone is worth the monthly value. And then you have resources, a, a presentation from me, the community, all the things in between on top of it. Do you have to attend all the things? No, 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 please. Don't add to your over full plate you should attend what feels relevant and exciting to you. And if you can't attend the live, that's okay. Um, thank you so much for sharing. Kayla says, La Familia Loca is the best. So many benefits. I'm a Canadian French teacher. And oh no, it went away. The rest of it went away, Kayla. I'm sorry, I pinned it though, because it was so good. You come and get what you want. Exactly, exactly. You come for what you want. And then the rest is recorded if you want to come back to it. Um, I have a couple members that just come for the resources and the guest of the month speaker. I have a, two members who told me last time, I'm sorry, but in the last 
I'm sorry, but in the last couple of years, all I've done is, or not last couple of years, the last couple of months, all I've done is the lanyap session because that's all I have capacity for. Lanyap is our extra one, right? The fun one. If all you have time for is the one that makes you feel good, then that's good. Oh, wait, hold on. You see him frequently. Come see. There he is, this guy. Wouldn't be possible without him. You also see my kids frequently because I'm a mom. And so they are not way better than you. You are my rock and my foundation. I love you so much. Um, I couldn't do it without him. And a lot of the sessions are actually after the kids are in bed because I need to put that first. Right? Um, but so fabulous. Okay. Viviana is on Facebook. Viviana says, hey, y'all, I just wanted to say that um, one of my biggest takeaways from La Familia Loca is that joy in the classroom doesn't happen by accident. Annabelle has so many strategies to bring purposeful joy to students and teachers. Thank you, Viviana. Um, I didn't even tell Viviana I was going live tonight. You know why? Because she does so much for me. I don't want to add one more thing. Bennett or <laughs> Profe Bennett. Morgan says hi. He says, hey, Morgan. Um, she does so much for me and I knew if I added one more thing, she'd be like, of course, I'll be there. So thank you for that real authentic comment. Um, Viviana uses everything as well. And Viviana is really the mastermind behind why resources look beautiful. <laughs> because I have vision for it. And I know what I want, but I don't know how to make it look nice. And Viviana is just like, oh, she beautifies everything. She makes everything so beautiful. Bob is one of our members on Facebook. Bob, thanks for joining us. <laughs> Bob, I, Bob is not even live on Facebook. He makes a comment and it makes me laugh. Like Bob comes and he brings so much joy to our meeting. Bob, I was talking about you today. Um, in one of my classes, and then I brought you up to a teacher from North Carolina who's an elementary teacher who asked if it would be a good fit. And I was like, oh, let me let me direct you to Bob. Bob says, hi, Loka, I'm trying to get on Zoom so I can give you props. I'm not on Zoom, Bob. Oh, wait, dang, Bob. No, I'm not on Zoom. <laughs> Sorry, Bob. <laughs> um, okay, so Bob, I love you so much. There is not a Zoom link. Bob, why don't you tell me what your favorite thing about La Familia Loca is and I will post the comment on Facebook and then I will read it out loud to the Instagram community. I love you. Um, another great question. I missed it. How often does, how do I say your name? Is it Vivi? How often does La Familia Loca meet and where do I get the info? After this live, I will be, I, I'll have this recording and I will give you the link to the site where you go and check it out and read all the things and make sure it feels right. And the information on how you can either become a monthly member or an annual member. If you sign up for the annual, you get all of that extra stuff unlocked immediately. And it takes two months off of the price. It's two months for free. Um, that's a great question. Where do I get the info? So I will give you that information. That reminds me of another question I haven't answered, but let me get this live one first. Oh snap, Bob says, oh snap. <laughs> Well, I could say so much about why people should join. <laughs> okay, tell us all the things, Bob. Why should people join? Okay, um, Gaty says, foreign language department has two weeks process payment. I really want to join. Can you hold it for me? I want a month, but I may change for the year. Is that okay? What I want you to do is send me an email. If you are in the boat where you have requested payment from your department and you can send me, show, like show me that you've requested it, I can pin a spot for you. Absolutely. Um, <laughs> Bob says the resources are just so amazing. Vivi and Annabelle have done all the prep for you. It's like getting Annabelle as a workshop every time you join a live event. I love you, Bob. You mean so much to me. I'm so grateful for you. Okay, um, let's see what other question. Oh, yes. Um, Oh, hi, Shasha, how are you? Oh my God, he was my tour guide in, um, in Varanasi, India, so fun. Okay, this was a question, Maestra. This was a teacher, oh, I won't say her name in case she doesn't want to be named. Um, I teach elementary and I'm not sure if this will be applicable to me. 
Somebody else emailed me today. I teach high school. Is this right for me? Because everyone knows Maestra Loca is elementary or middle school, upper elementary or middle school. That's where my hot point is. Y'all, I have so many teachers who teach little littles. And I have an idea for making this even cooler for elementary um, teachers, but I haven't thought that through yet. But let's that's down the down the line. There are loads of elementary teachers in my community. There are loads of high school teachers in my community. You just heard live from two. Bob and Morgan are both high school teachers. Kayla, who posted that comment, is in Canada. She teaches elementary kids. The community is diverse in its makeup of levels of experience with language acquisition, also in the levels that we teach and the grades we teach. The, the group that I feel is most underserved because I love to be transparent with you is my upper level teachers, my the people who just serve three, four AP uh, students. I still have maybe about 20 of those people who only teach those levels who are still in the community because I still hire people. For example, the other month, I just had Jenny Wetzig present on using music in our upper, upper levels as full units. That would be something you would have access to because it was within the last few months. But they still are there for that and just for the joy in the community, right? So I feel like that's the most underserved group, but everybody has a place. Everybody has a place. And during our community work time sessions, that's really, 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 really important because we break into our cohorts. Like all the elementary teachers get together and meet together. All of the middle school teachers get together and meet together. All the high school teachers get together and meet together. Some people just come to that because they feel like a one person department or they are one. Either they feel like it because they don't have the support or they are legitimately a one person department. And so there's that. Uh, imagine getting, thank you, Bob. Imagine getting one of the masters of CI as your friend and coach. This, Bob, yes. Okay, I spit a little bit. Bob, okay. I love this comment because Alana sent me a video tonight to share with my communities to let them know, like, if you're on the fence, join. And Alana used the words very similar to this. She said, imagine somebody who believes in you like you believe in your students. And I do, I believe in my teachers. I believe in our community. I believe in how they make me feel empowered and, and how they cheerlead for me. And I believe I can do the same for you. And, and I think that that's so important. So I love those words, Bob, thank you. OMG, Bob says, OMG, elementary kids love you, but my high school kids love to laugh too. They love the power of unicorn pee. High school students need magic. Magic is stolen from us too soon. I love that you actually use unicorn pee. I love you. Uh, he also says, as a world language teacher, you need reinforcement and inspiration because there's a, uh, a oh, maybe, God, maybe I don't know what that word is. There is a something of it in your schools and department. Is dearth a word? I don't know. Um, and you get that with Familia Loca. You need inspiration, you get that here. You need reinforcement, you get that here. It will refill your cup. Yes, Bob, preach. Dang, Bob, I should have like coordinated for you to come on. <laughs> I just didn't wanna add anything to y'all's plates. Um, Annabelle for principal, my ears are open. I'm one person department, K through eight Spanish, 950 students, and I'm so considering this, I need more. Okay, let me tell you, we have a member in our community who also recorded a video for me to share tomorrow. And she teaches virtually. She has up to how many students? Is it 95 students per class? She teaches 95 kids online at a time. Her students are in, she has 1400 students this year, I think. It's like an insane number. And she teaches elementary K, K5 Spanish. Oh my God, like insane. Also a department of, of one, teaches from home, teaches remotely, like 
needs that community and that's what we can give her as La Familia Loca. Her video is beautiful. I can't wait to share it on social tomorrow. Um, we have a high school collab meetup that is fire. That's from Morgan. Morgan is, um, it was literally not told to be here. I need to say that again. And Morgan is saying that, yes, we have a high school collab that is fire. Morgan leads that for me. Morgan is my high school person and it is fire largely in part because Morgan is there and Morgan is an incredible high school language teacher. And let me tell you, that is also electric. I am damn good at hiring my people because Morgan's personality is perfect for that high school group. Like perfect. Nicole's personality is perfect for my middle school teachers. People love her. But Nicole wouldn't be perfect for the high school people and Morgan wouldn't be perfect for the middle school people. And Chio and her expertise is ideal for my elementary teachers. It is like this beautiful, magical thing that Viviana and I just get to sit back and go, look at what we've done. Like, this is freaking awesome. It's the best. It is the best. I love it. Okay. 85 students. Okay. You are watching on, in, on Facebook. Of course you are. Allison is on Facebook. She's the, the teacher with all of the, all of the students. She says she has 85 students. I'm here and I love you. Your support has changed my life. <laughs> Y'all. <laughs> it's such a gift doing this is such a gift. I am so lucky because um, I told this to my community and somebody um, the other night. It is self-care for me, sharing with teachers and hearing comments like that. Like, I know I'm making an impact on, on educators and their kids on a monthly basis. And I feel so fortunate to do it, so fortunate. Um, ooh, this is brilliant. Sugar muffins. Yes, Bob. She has so many students. Who Allison also says, I've had the good fortune to have a few coaching sessions with Annabelle. She has a wealth of information and experience. She goes all in. My fave about her is that she is caring, genuine, and a supportive human. So Allison actually, since she mentioned that, I'm going to go ahead and put that out there. She actually bought the highest tier available. There's only five of these available each time I open La Familia Loca. And it is a it is a three year subscription to La Familia Loca PLC in addition to three quarterly coaching sessions of 30 minutes each. So I can really spend one on one time with you and see you and help you grow through the entire school year. And Allison was one of those people. And I was like, oh boy, you're virtual. Okay, let's go. And we just our time is so fun together and Allison's energy is so similar to mine and we just have a ball. I know Dr. Tabi, also Getty, making like waves in our state of Louisiana, changing things and making, making waves. Um, Shio says, Annabelle, thanks for impacting my teaching and helping me be a better teacher for my students. I'm loving being part of La Familia Loca PLC. All of my people that are my um, team, actually still pay for full-time memberships. I should probably work on that with y'all. You probably shouldn't be paying for something when I have you hired on, but they want to be there. I didn't hire people who are not part of the community because I wanted people who were already familiar, who knew, who knew what it was about and who were committed to the same values as me. I wanted people who were committed to creating inclusive spaces in our world language cl classrooms and empowering our students. I wanted people who wanted to develop communicative competency and a global perspective in our students. And I knew I wanted teachers to be leaders with me. There is lots of room for people to grow in our community, even the people who are already in that experience level, because that's when I reach out and say, hey, you want to present? You want to be our guest of the month? What can you share? What do you have to share? Because I want, I want the people who have been doing this for 22 years, double what I've been doing, to, to I, I want to hear from them. But they're also part of our community. And that's something that Goyo, who was another member, 
he and his review for me mentions in his video, he said, I think that's what makes this group so ele electric is that you have the expertise of many teachers at various experience levels teaching all around the country and the world sharing their perspectives and their successes and their wins. Um, we've created a space for people to ask questions about inclusivity. Yes, 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 that is so it. That's it, Morgan. Largely due to Morgan came and gave an incredible presentation, incredible on how do we start the year creating inclusive spaces. And if you're new to this, welcome, let's do the work. How do we make sure our students feel seen, heard, loved, valued, accepted, cared for as they are? And if they're not ready to be that yet in our space, allow them that time and that space, right? Um, if you're looking to, to bring inclus inclusivity and equitable practice into the classroom, but don't know where to start, we have convos in a safe way that Morgan leads us in. She's one of my one of my true experts. Um, okay, Bob again. <laughs> Bob is on Facebook, and Bob says, "Teaching is freaking hard, and you need to surround yourself with positive colleagues." Too many PLCs turn into bitch sessions where teachers are the low are the lows. La familia will give you the roses. You need to recharge your batteries every day. Oh my God, Bob. I swear to you, I didn't know. I didn't tell him that this was happening. I didn't even, I even reached out to them last night and was like, y'all, if you have anything positive to say about the community, let me know. <laughs> I didn't even tell them that I was doing this. Bob, that's so good. La Familia will give you the roses you need to recharge your batteries every day. Mm, that's good. Might have to keep that one. Might need to make that into a shirt. Bob, I still haven't made all the other shirt designs that you have talked about. We need to we need to sit down and make all the shirts happen, all the merch happen, Bob. What are we doing with our lives? My sweet Caroline just joined. We had the best time co-teaching last year. Can you imagine being a student teacher during a pandemic? She kicked but Yes, Caroline reached out to me on Instagram. And I didn't even know it was her, but she was like, hey, I'm looking for like the letter to ask her funding for my department. If you need that letter, let me know. After this, I'm gonna post the recording and I'm also gonna post the recording on Facebook and on YouTube. If you need that letter to request funding, do it. Request funding, I'll send it to you. I have a pre-typed letter that you just have to fill in the blanks, add your name, add your why, and, um, and then it's ready to go. Turn it in, ask for funding. And right now, y'all, let me tell you, the amount of teachers who have said, thank you for getting me to ask. There were three teachers who said, thank you for getting me to ask. They did have a surplus in the budget. They were able to approve it. Not all of our schools are that generous. Some of you will be paying out of pocket. I get that. Um, I pay out of pocket for the three teacher communities that I'm part of that teach me how to be a better teacher for teachers. I pay out of pocket. Um, I know that's hard. In fact, it was an incredible investment when we started. We did not have the money for it, but I said, we need to make the money. We need to make the time and money for this because I want to be a better teacher of teachers. And I want to make this something that I don't need to give everything away for fee. I know what the value of this program is and it is not touching the value yet. <laughs> the price, the, it is, it, this is incredible y'all. It's truly it's incredible. I'm so glad Caroline joined. I sent some welcome videos today. I'm really, really excited. Okay, y'all, I'm ready to get off of here, drink some more wine, cheers to that, and share some links with you. If you are interested, shoot me an email, shoot me a DM. I can send you the link personally. I want to make sure that you feel like it's a good fit before you make the commitment. But let's do this. Let's finish this year strong. Let's finish this year with you feeling supported and heard. I want to celebrate you. Um, I'm really, really excited. Yay, Caroline just signed up. I'm working with Viviana. Working with Viviana was the most amazing learning experience ever. I couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Yes. It's so cute, Viviana, because you're watching on Facebook and Caroline's watching on Instagram. And it's the sweetest thing. Oh. I got to say, instead of being nipped to death like a duck on TPT, to pay out of pocket, pay out of pocket instead of doing things piecemeal. Systematically change your practice. 
systematically change your practice. Holy crud. Systematically change your practice. Bob, you want to be my copyright person? You have a way with words. Golly. Golly. Okay. Se oh, thank you, Heidi. Heidi says, seriously, you won't regret it. Join us. I know you won't regret it. I would love to have you join, join, join. Um, a 20 something year old on Instagram and an almost 40 year old on Facebook is about as poetic as it gets. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, y'all. I love you. Have a beautiful, wonderful night. Go to bed. I won't be, so I can't tell you that I will be. Um, but it's okay. It's a busy week. I want to make sure everybody feels um, like this, if they're making this commitment, that it's the right fit for them. Um, so I'm going to go to bed in a little bit. I get to go on a field trip tomorrow. So I'm really pumped up on that. Uh, my first four, first field trip in four years that I've taught at the school. Super pumped. And um, let's have a great Thursday tomorrow. I'm sorry, excuse my language. Let's have a great Friday Eve tomorrow because that's what it is. Bob, it sounds awesome. Cheers, enjoy your night and happy Thursday. Yes, 